area high school, we have a lot of courses in the agri-science department that allow students to not only learn important career skills, but actually apply them through some tremendous facilities and some of our lab experiences. We hope you explore what we offer and maybe discover a passion and pursue some interests that might turn into a career or just things that would help you in your own experiences. The courses that we offer in the Agri-Science Department fulfill two of the pathways that we have here at Stillwood Area High School, STEM in the Environment, Health and Human Services are two of the pathways, as well as we have some courses that will fulfill or meet the core requirement for graduation. One of the courses that is a good foundation for students with an interest in animals is our Animal Care and Management course. Uh, this course will cover dogs, cats, birds, and assorted other animals, and we focus on identifying what these breeds are within there. We also spend a lot of time so they know what they should be feeding, uh, some things about uh, safe handling and behavior and care. For those students that want to pursue their interest in the animals, um, after animal care and management, they could take vet science. With that class, they're going to learn a little bit more about the anatomy of animals. They'll also be doing some dissections. Kids that take this class don't necessarily have to go on to pursue vet medicine, but it's a great experience for them to gain some knowledge about what that might entail. We have a college in the schools animal science course at Stillwater Area High School, and this is a tremendous opportunity for students. They can earn four college credits at the University of Minnesota, and that's free for those students. So we teach the curriculum here, plus we also are able to do uh, field trips to the U of M to do some labs with the animals there. In this greenhouse, as well as in the classroom, we'll be learning about how to grow plants um, from seeds all the way to cuttings and how those can be used for plant production in a variety of careers that are related to plant science. A lot of hands-on opportunities for us to explore when growing green um, and utilizing the plants. One of the classes that we have that meets one of the core requirements would be floral design. Students in this class will actually do designs with fresh flowers as well as our permanent botanicals. And in addition to working with the flowers, they will also utilize some of the greenhouse for plant production and learning a little bit about the flower industry or the flower business. If you have an interest in the outdoors or the environment, check out Sustaining Our Environment. This course will give you an opportunity to get out into our Stillwater High School 40 Acre Environmental Learning Center. It'll also get you a chance to participate in activities in our high school greenhouse, along with our trout hatchery, as you learn about ways that you can help to improve the environment locally. In Fish and Wildlife One, students will get a chance to learn about Minnesota's fish, mammals, and birds, starting with our trout hatchery lab, and students get a chance to be part of raising them up and then stocking them into Browns Creek the following spring. Browns Creek is also a field trip for the students to go out and do stream monitoring, get a chance just to see what's out there in the stream that are part of the trout habitat. Students also have the opportunity to go and utilize our 40 acre environmental learning center for a variety of wildlife surveys. In addition to those, we also have a thorough collection that no school in Minnesota has of uh, specimens for study. A good chance to, to really see in real life what some of these uh, great specimens are in Minnesota. In Fish and Wildlife 2, students will build on what they learned in Fish and Wildlife 1. They will learn about a lot of mammals, birds, and fish that we didn't cover in Fish and Wildlife 1, in addition to Minnesota's reptiles, amphibians, and pollinators. Students will also get a chance to take the things that we've learned more to the next level of management and looking at making some decisions about uh, our trout hatchery and evaluating their, their growth. Biotechnology is a class that we offer here as well. It's a very hands-on lab-based class where students can learn cutting edge skills for a lab. Um, we are, have the equipment here that students can actually utilize that fulfill both the STEM and the environment pathway as well as in the health and human services pathway. Great class for students to utilize and to have an experience with. Our food science course is an option for students to earn their chemistry credit for graduation. We take all of the concepts that are important in chemistry and students learn about it through food and nutrition. We do a lot of food related labs. We have a smoothie lab where students can create an antioxidant rich smoothie to apply what they've learned. 
So whether you enjoy the environment and the outdoors, or you have an interest in animals, or you have an interest in plants, the Agri-Science Department offers a variety of things for a variety of student interests. So feel free to pick a course, pursue a passion, and as you have questions, a great place to go would be our Stillwater High School website under curriculum and take a look at the registration and course descriptions that are found there.